Okay guys, I'm in Ilz of Mineola. They're about to build it, but I'm taking a similar um, home pattern from there. This is the Magnolia. It's a four bedroom, two and a half bath, two story home. It is about 2,000 square feet. As you could hear, they're still building here. I'm actually in Hardwood Landing, but the same builder will be building in Hills of Mineola. Um, and they're gonna be building some of the same similar homes. This is gonna be Elevation A. They have Elevation B and C to choose from. The elevation means the front will be different. So on this one, we have a little porch out here. And we're gonna go in on the front, in the front door. Now, this was, this is not a model home. This was built for a regular buyer. So, which means you're not gonna see a lot of upgrades. Now, what this buyer did choose to do is he chose to do tiles all of downstairs. There's gonna be tile all of downstairs. He did choose the builder's choice for the kitchen cabinets. You do have a choice of gourmet kitchen, but this particular buyer did not do the gourmet kitchen. The granite you're looking at is the builder's choice as well. So that's what this particular buyer went with. And he also went with the backdrop from the builder as well. So that's what the kitchen looks like. Off the kitchen, we have the laundry room. He did not put cabinets or anything like that in this laundry room. So you'd be getting your own washer and dryer and exactly what you're seeing is what you would get directly from the builder. From there, we're gonna to go to the garage. It offers a two car garage. This particular buyer chose to epoxy the garage floor. So that's epoxied. The two car garage, let's do this. And let's go back this way. So then, this is a little butler's pantry here. You have um, a regular pantry here. And then across from there, that door that we're looking at is the aft bath. Now we're gonna continue down. Now you do have some choices on this model. You could choose a nine foot slider with a triple door. That, you, that way you have an either way door. This particular buyer did not choose that. If you choose that though, you would lose this window that we're looking at, okay? So let's continue on. The master for this is downstairs. This particular buyer chose to do tiles all over downstairs, so the master is tiled. From there, we're gonna go in the bathroom. Now, everything you're looking at here is um, included with this, because th this buyer did not do too much upgrades. So with the shower, you do have double, a double shower for your master and you could choose frame this build, this buyer chose a frame door but you could choose frame or on frame doors here he did not choose that and from there it leads into we have a little water closet here and from the water closet we have the master closet and this is the master closet at least back into the back, into the thing. So I like to show some of these homes that someone buys because you get to see it without the bells and the whistles and all the different upgrades and kind of give you an idea of what it would look like if you didn't choose some of the upgrades. This light fixture is the builder's choice. The granite is the builder's choice. And the fixtures there that you're looking at, the pipe fixtures are the builder's choice. The cabinet is also the builder's choice. So if you wanted to get lighter cabinets, you would need to upgrade that as well. So sometimes it's good to look at it without all the upgrades so you see what the house would look like. So all the light fixtures we're looking at here is the builder's choice. Up here is where we are, it's wired for two pendant lights so you'd put those in. And the good news about this is you could do lots of different upgrades to it. You do have a two story entrance, which is awesome. Let's go upstairs for this particular model. The buyer decided to um, do carpet, so all of downstairs is styled, all the upstairs is carpeted. So as we get up to the top of the floor, this is a four bedroom, two and a half bath with one bedroom. The master is downstairs. Once we get upstairs, we do have a loft. We have bedroom number two. I wanted to show you the bedrooms first. Then we have a bathroom in between those bedrooms. So as you see, this particular bar did not upgrade much. Um, builder's choice light fixtures, builder's granite, builder's piping fixtures. You got a bathtub there. You do have a choice. You could do a bath here or you could do a shower. 
we have bedroom number three. Now, you see how the, seat, the light is here? That is also a fan box. So you can move that light fixture in each bedroom and you could put a fan up there as well because it's wired for that. This is the fourth bedroom. Now this builder, if you use their preferred lender, they pay most of your closing costs and they also give you $7,000 in the design center. And this is the loft. As you come upstairs, so let me do that again for you. You come upstairs, you hit the loft area, very big loft area here. You could have a TV, office, whatever you want, whatever it is that suits your family. We could see the two-story entrance better from here. So if you use their preferred lender, they pay most of your closing costs. They also give you $7,000 on design. For Hills of Mineola, they're still doing contracts. That development is just about to open. They're gonna have a huge thing there. It's gonna be a huge development with new schools, a shopping center, a sports complex. It's gonna be really big. There's four different builders building there. This particular model that we're in is built by Dreamfinder Homes, but we also have Starlight Homes, Ashton Woods, and Meritage Homes still building in Hills of Mineola. Um, so if you have any questions, feel free to give us a call, send us a text. Um, but this is a great time to get in there because the builder is also helping to buy down your interest rate as well. So you get your closing costs paid if you use their lender, you get $7,000 in design, and they help to buy down your interest rate as well. So that's a great option, guys. So see you in the next video.